what I started to do when I'm asked to write something or think about writing something. Um, and, you know, you're sent books or sent ideas and you're asked to think about, you know, I just think, cut your head off and imagine there's no such thing as money. And only listen to this, like, because you, like, as far as I'm concerned, you're going to lie on your deathbed and you're going, why did I spend two years doing a remake of that Disney film? <laughs> or maybe you wouldn't, because you'd have a very nice bed. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you're lying there in a very plush bed. <laughs> Oh, I'm drowning in all these feathers. God, it's so hard. I think sometimes, no, but I, I actually, I just mean that like, if you can try and, and make your choices from what actually gives you a buzz, because what gives you a buzz is probably the truth. The more, that's the essence. That's like your true um, expression or something. Like that's something that you truly want to express about. And there's all that thing with an artist as well of, mm -hmm. um, I think freedom and responsibility. You, as an artist, you absolutely have to burn all your bridges all the time, never get defined. Mm -hmm. uh, on the other hand, then you also do have responsibility because we are all one organism and we affect one another. Yeah. So it's kind of balancing those two things, maybe. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. I agree with that. OK. <laughs> <laughs> I can't answer. <laughs> Yeah, More. I was just figuring it out there as I was saying it, and I, I, I got really to the end. It's really good figuring it out. I got out. to the end. Yes, yep, yeah, okay. <laughs> Over to you now.